Hi, if you are wondering if you can get a Google Store to your Fire Stick, then the short answer is no, but the right answer is you can get an alternative which works exactly as Google Store and it's called Aurora Store. In general, it's just a different store which also has a lot of applications, games and everything which you may need on your Fire Stick. And here's how it looks like. So at the top, we can see top free, top grossing and trending apps as well as top paid apps. So let's see what you can find here. So we can go to top three and we'll see the top three applications in my country. So some applications like Spotify, YouTube Kids and different ones should be quite easily recognizable for you. Other ones might be not because I'm located in Eastern Europe. For you, the applications might be a bit different. Now let's take a look at top grossing. So it's of course Disney+, Plus, Prime Video, ESPN, TV Mate, APTV, NFL, MigoGo, Video TV, and other ones. Then we can check out top paid apps. As you can see, it's IPTV Pro, AirPlay, PS Play, MX Player Pro, and some other apps. And of course, we'll find way more applications if we go to just categories. So there is a plenty of categories to choose from, such as beauty, business, comics, dating, education, entertainment, of course. Let's open entertainment, let's say, and see what's inside. As you can see here, you can find Kijo TV with movies for kids, as well as LTT with web series and Watcha. And those were just apps from the entertainment categories, but of course, there are tens, if not hundreds, of apps in different categories on this application. Or you could even go to games and see what games are available for you on this application as well. And then there's also a For You section, which somehow decides on what applications might be interesting for you. So there's Daz and Viaplay for sports, Fox News, SunCloud, Radio FM, and loads of different applications. So let's say you want to download UFC, you click on the app, then you gotta click on install. <clears throat> and from now on, the process is quite similar. You just click on install and continue with the installation. And now let me show you how you can actually get the Aurora Store to your Fire TV stick. So here's the application which we need to download. But first of all, of course, we'll need to use a downloader to do so, because Aurora TV is not available on the official Amazon App Store. So you open the downloader app. Here we'll have to type a code, which is going to be 28907. So once again, the code is 28907, and then you press on go. Then a web page is going to open, which we have to scroll down a bit until we see a list of categories, and here we'll have to click on App Stores. Then you'll see a list of applications and you gotta open Aurora Store. After that, a new web page is opening, which we also have to scroll down and keep scrolling until you see that little download button. Now the download has started. Click on install here in the right bottom corner. And before actually clicking open, instead press on done. Here you'll be able to delete the installation file because we don't need any more. So click on delete. And now if you go to the list of apps on your device, you'll find the Aurora Store here. But there is one more thing which I recommend getting before actually using Aurora. It's of course the mouse toggle application, which is going to allow you to use a mouse cursor on any app. So here's how it looks like. It basically allows you to use a mouse cursor on any application and it's going to make your life way easier. So I do have a full tutorial on how to set up a mouse toggle on my channel. So I'll just leave a link for that in the description of that video. Now that we got the mouse toggle set up and ready to use, let's go and set up Aurora. Turn on mouse toggle. So here we'll have to accept the terms of service. Click on that check mark and then press accept. Then press on next. Here you can select which team you'd like. So it can be light for a light team, dark, pitch black, or just use the system as I do. Then it's going to be white in that case. Here you can also select a color for your interface. It's completely up to you. I honestly quite like the basic purple look. Here it is. Press on next. And here we'll have to grant permission for Aurora to download other apps from the internet. Click on grant here firstly. Open installation of unknown apps and turn that option on for the downloader. Then click back on your remote and click here on the grant once again. Then press allow as it's needed for Aurora to install other apps from the internet. And then press on finish. At this stage, I recommend pressing on anonymous. And that's it, now you can use the app store on your Fire TV stick.